Mason Brand Airstream and hanging out with Angela Pearlie and the Howlin' Moons. Hey guys, what's up? Hey, not too much. <laughs> not too much, just chilling? Yeah, we're excited to play. The stage looks amazing in there, so we're real excited. Awesome, awesome. And then you at the end, if you feel like grabbing the mic at any time, please feel free. <laughs> Mine. But, um, like, we're excited to have you here. You guys have played a few shows, right? Or you got Awesome. How's it been so far? It's been great. The crowd's been great. Really nice. Uh, we've met a lot of good people. So. Awesome. How's, how's the difference between... You guys are from Ohio, right? How's the difference between there and Austin? Um, there's cactus plants here. Um, and it's warm. And there's a lot of, like, really good food trucks and tacos. The tacos aren't as abundant in Columbus. Uh, I mean, I can imagine. What what is what has been like a changing factor for you when it comes to Austin? There's just there's just Tex-Mex everywhere. We've had at one point we had to like stop eating Tex-Mex food. You know, it's just starting to affect our our overall body symptoms, our system. So, um, and then just I'm not I haven't been here when it wasn't South by Southwest, so I don't know how many venues there are, but there's just seems like there's obviously because of the festival, there's just a ton of uh, venues. And we've seen, we've been knocked out by some of the bands here. Just knocked out. Especially it was Wednesday and yesterday were really, really great days for music for us. So we, we lucked out. Awesome. What is something that you're looking forward to for like this like last little leg of it? Is there someone that you're looking forward to seeing or somewhere you're looking forward to performing? I don't know. Tonight we're not planning it out as much. We'll just kind of see what happens. And, you know, we loaded in early. We're going to play and then check out some music. So. Yo. Anything you're looking forward to? Well, I heard we're stopping in Memphis on the way back, so I'm going to get some barbecue. But, uh, you know, I don't know about you. Uh, I miss my kids. I want to get home and sit down. Aw, shout out to family. <laughs> so, no, I mean, it, I mean it, it can probably be a lot. Hey, where'd my tongue go? I'm sure it can be really difficult being on the road, um, especially for long periods of time away from family and friends. What's something that kind of keeps you sane? Um, for us, just listening to music, uh, running, walking around. I don't know. Yeah, just digging into new cities that we, we haven't been to or haven't frequented that much. It's really fun. Um, hanging out with new friends. We seem to like to do that a lot. We made a lot of great friends here in Austin, so got to spend time with them and then just hanging out with each other. How did, what was the question? It was, um, like, you know, on, being on the road a lot can, you know, kind of take a toll on you. What is something that kind of keeps you sane while you're away from friends and family? Oh, uh, FaceTime. I need to FaceTime my friends from back home, family. Uh, yeah, I FaceTime my dog. Yeah, I, I realized that I can't call his name out because it freaks him out. So I just, like, look at him. The first time I yelled and he, like, jumped off the bed and ran across the house and freaked out, but... Um, yeah, uh, we blow off some steam a little bit uh, from time to time at night, and we wake up in the morning and go running. Uh, awesome. So, I mean, you guys have been together for a little bit. Yeah. What would you say helps keep, you know, the bond between you guys pretty strong? Um, I think just, just making music, and we're very open-minded people. Uh, we're kind of, we, we've, we're friends, so that helps. That, that's, you know, we all get along, so that's kind of the huge puzzle piece that works. Is there times where you just kind of want to throw something at the other end, one of the other members? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> there are those times where you're just like, you, you just, you need to stop. I'm gonna... <laughs> so... What is like a piece of advice you would give to other musicians that are out on the road to help, like you know, keep that, keep it tight? Yeah, I would say just practice, practice, and really believe what you're doing. Um, if you do that, good things are gonna happen. Awesome. So, like this coming year, what's in the works for you guys? What is there anything coming out? Is there anything new? We're working on our new record right now. Hopefully, it'll be out like this fall, late fall. So. Um, what, what sound are you going for on it? It's definitely rock and roll, but there's a dreamy element to this record. Definitely dreamy theme going on. So. Awesome. And then... Uh, it's, it's, coming, it's coming along pretty well. So sometimes we have, you have to rethink things periodically throughout uh, the recording process. We're happy so far the way it's working out. So we're excited. We can't wait to start. We've been playing some of the songs, but there's about five on there that we still don't even know the na title of the song. You know, it's, it's kind of gotten to that point, to that point yeah, where we've got to figure out what the title's going to be called. And then just um, get start working them out in a live setting. It's gonna be. I'm excited to do that. 
Are you guys are you guys gonna be playing anything new for us tonight? Um, uh, I'm trying to think. Do we have anything? I don't think so. Not in this set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. And then I know you guys are on tour. Um, you do you're doing a tour with somebody's darling, right? Uh, like meeting up on, in different parts of it. How has that been? I mean, like I mean, you guys are from kind of opposite ends of the country. Like, how has it been working with them? Yeah, it's good. They're great. We've we we enjoy watching them play. We enjoy their music. Um, we're gonna bring them to Ohio at the uh, beginning of April. So yeah, it's been good. It's been really good. Awesome. Great. So. So I mean, we're looking forward to your guys' set. It's gonna be awesome. I mean, I'm really excited to see you because this is my first time seeing you guys. And thank you again for hanging out with us. Find them on Facebook and Twitter and everything else. Angela Perley and the Howlin' Moons. And look forward to their new record coming out in the fall.